Ja, milk and cookies. <laughs> Who needs borders? What is that? Okay, for those who are federally recognized, it's a blessing. But those are more keepers to legitimize how native I am or I am not. My father is from Peru. My mother is from Santa Rosa de la Mexico. Mayo Indian. Yaki. If the border was further south in Santa Rosalia, I'd be considered Native American. I couldn't be quiet right now when young brother said of this First Nations. You know what? This government taught us to hate ourselves and each other. We do not have land. We do not have the right to clean water. They are polluting the land. They are ruining it for everyone. Right now, when you go home and you pour yourself a tall, cool one, give thanks. You are blessed because tomorrow it is not promised. And so right now, I have to remind all of you that it doesn't matter if we're federally recognized. It doesn't matter if we're state recognized. Those of us who are native, we know it. Those of us who are warriors, we know it. Sad condition of our of our day today, our event today. We have brothers and sisters today who are lost because they don't know their native roots. They don't know that they are Cherokee, that they are Blackfeet, Seminole, or, or Lakota. That is sad. That is a tragic thing. That is criminal. That needs to be corrected. Because there are, there are more papers waiting for them. There are scholarships waiting for the young, for the youth. Those go unused. Those go unused every year. Sitting there. The last thing I want to say to you is where you stand, where you stand, where you sit, that is your poem. That is your story. That is your prayer. Because cursing through your veins is the ancestors, your ancestors' DNA, their memories, your warrior roots, who you are. Be proud. Bow down to no one. Please, you, please, and thank you. Please remember that your elders are watching from near and far, and that your community does not just reach this L.A. County. It is beyond these city limits, beyond the state limits, because I don't subscribe to the motherfucking border. I don't subscribe to the border. Thank you, sister. Brother has something to say. Yeah. But we got to respect what happened. This country was founded on imperialistic politicization. We got to remember, though, the first slaves on this planet were women. We have to remember that men have been fighting wars. Men have been competing with each other. So they're asking us to move to the sidewalk so that we no longer have to speak And I'm asking you as a person of color who is having a about safety that we move over right now so that we don't have our folks dealing with the police. So if we are moving to the sidewalk, that's beautiful and wonderful because I want us all to be safe because we